Hello everyone, my name is Odinson and this is Modded Minecraft. Um, this is episode 10 of my Direwolf 21.19 playthrough. Uh, here I am and you might see that I've been busy doing some decorative stuff. So I decided to start actually like making this somewhat presentable. Um, I've done all the floor in here. One of the problems I've had was that I forgot this was only one layer thick in places. So um, we've got a big paved area out here now. But I mean, it's not really too much of a problem. But what I'm going to show you is the um, exchange of gadget. Also, I'm not wearing my jetpack because I killed an enderman that came into my base. And he gave me this, which gives me lots of extra health and also a walking speed boost. So when I don't need to fly, I think I'm going to be using this. But anyway, I wanted to do the floor down here now in a slightly different um, tile. So you do is you place a block in the world, you shift, right click it, and then you can pick that block back up. And then what you can do is you just right click along where you want to replace. Easy peasy. So I'm just going to do this floor. Uh, no, obviously we can't do the elevator. What this does is it will replace stuff into my inventory or into my um, pocket storage, which is handy, except for ores and stuff like that that aren't in my pocket storage. So anything that's not in my pocket storage will go into my inventory. So I'm probably going to end up with a load of actual cooked stone here, which is a good thing because I'm always needing it. I'm um, going to get those gobble blocks. But I just wanted to do um, a different pattern down here on the floor with tiling just to break stuff up a bit. And what I'll do is I'll keep some of this stuff in my inventory because I don't want to have to like break everything and replace it right now. <clears throat> but when and if I move stuff, I will replace the floor underneath it as and when I can. Go into there like that. Perfect. Okay. Nearly there. Of course, it's raining outside, as you could hear, as per usual. My episodes. Okay, we're coming up to these crystals now, which can be a bit finicky in places, I guess. But. Let's get all this bit done first. The range on this thing is actually really good, which makes it really helpful. Okay. Uh, got that. Can I get you? Yes. Okay. And do all these. All right. And what I did to get these tiles was I used soapstone and used a uh, stone cutter. And you can get these bricks and then the tiles. And I've run out. So there's the bits that I was picking up from um, exchanging. Uh, how, how much more have I got? Hopefully a couple. A stack. Ooh, it's going to be tight. I'm going to have to take every single one I've got, I think. Have I got any up here in storage? EV. Soapstone, deep slate, hmm, gonna be tight. So you just literally hit it like that, it's all good. And then we um, come back downstairs. One of the downsides of running fast is I keep missing my spot. Okay. Cross all our fingers and toes. Hope we've got enough. It's got to be close, whatever the outcome. Nope. Six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. well okay well i'll finish that little corner off in between episodes but look at that 
That looks so much better. These feral flare lanterns work really well. I'm happy with that. I'm really happy with that. All right, so um, I'm just going to... Yeah, when you sprint with this chest plate, oh, look how fast it is. It's crazy. Okay. Um, I know I'm up to six sheep out here, and I'm probably time to breed. Watch them all come crowded. One, two, three, four, five, six. And now we've got nine sheep. Pick up that experience. Excellent. All right. Uh, right, so what was I planning for today? Okay, so I don't need to make a stone cutter anymore. Uh, oh, yeah, laser I.O. Of course. We wanted to... Uh, semi-automate these for now and then fully automate them later which isn't oh my god the change in the vision it makes it more quake like look look you take it off it zooms in zooms out because you run faster so first thing i want to do is link all these to each other okay Right, so they're all linked to each other. So there's a path where items can travel along there now. Okay, so what I'm going to need is um, item cards, I believe. Yeah, these. All right. And then what I'm also going to need is... Um, what is this? Laser I.O., isn't it? Ah, uh, laser. And then I'm also going to need... Filters. Yes. Okay. Um. Um. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Let's just crack on and see how we go. All right. So what do I need? I'm gonna need iron bars. I'm gonna need gold nuggets, quartz. All right. I got a bunch of quartz now because I went to the nether and did some mining in between episodes as promised. Um, I want to get rid of this excess stuff out of my inventory because it's probably going to fill up pretty quickly. Okay. Uh, so quartz. I'm going to want some iron. Oops. I did not mean to do that. You can have the 51 back. In fact, you can have most of this back. Um, I need that 17. Okay. Uh, I needed gold nuggets, wasn't it? Meow. Yep. Uh, redstone and lapis, which I can get out of my pocket storage. So we'll take one of them, one of them. I'm actually going to put some stuff away, I think. Uh, oh, give me a sec here. So I'm going to put that, that, that. Yeah, I think that'll do for a minute. All right. Um, we need glass panes, so I'm going to get some gravel. Uh, I meant to get 12, but it doesn't really matter. Oh, this looks so bad. I really need to get this sorted between episodes. Um, all right, so we're going to do this. Good old time in a bottle. <clears throat> but yeah, it's going to look so much better. Notice the crystals are growing quite nicely over here. I'll get into that either this episode or the next one. All right, there goes the flint, so we're going to put the iron in there now. There's some glass. Make some glass panes. Perfect. That's the don't need right now. Yeah, yeah. Should be building up. Yeah, we're back over four hours again now. All right, perfect. So that's that. Uh, we wanted some iron bars, didn't we? 
Well, there's 16. Item filters. That makes four. All right, so let's make some of these. Start with eight, and then let's make some of these. Oh, we can't stack them. That's annoying. Uh, that's the start. Okay. So I've got iron. I need silicon, which means I do need to break one of these. So, like, when they're fully grown, they're just called certus quartz clusters. Break it, and you get some certus quartz. Now, did this one degenerate? No. So, break that. That's large. That's not done yet. That's a certus quartz crystal. That's a certus quartz crystal. There is that and see if you don't if you don't let them fully grow and you break you get dust instead look just like that I'm gonna break all this up because I want all the dust right now did any of these flawed flawed Forward, forward. Ah, there we go. So this one, downgraded one. There's a chance of downgraded one every time you break a crystal off it and everything. And that's gone down to like level two. Then it will go down to level three, and then it will turn just back to a crystal block. And um, I'll show you what happens with that after. All right. So we need some silicon, and uh, silicon, I believe, is just smelted certus dust. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make these. Uh, do that. All right. Okay, uh, I'm just trying to figure out how I'm going to go about this. So, which way am I facing north? Okay, so what I want to do is on the up. I want to insert on the white. Oh, I want to extract on white yeah and then on the north of all these I'm insert on white insert oops white north insert on white and you can see it's all going in here now in the right place. North. Insert on white. North. North. Insert on white. Perfect. Okay, so if I put a silicon in here. Where did that go? So that went into that one. Okay. Okay. What we want to do is this is where we get the uh, filters. So on the north, we put a item filter in there. Uh, silicon okay. what we want to do is we want to I know what I'm gonna do I know what I'm gonna do so we want a diamond 
And we've got a set of squads. Want a gold ingot if we have any left? Yes. Okay, so I'm just going to make one of each of these. So, gold versus diamond. And then on the north, on this one, I'm going to be putting an item filter in there. I want to have that, 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 that. And that's all we're allowing in there. Insert silicon. Need another gold and another diamond. See what I mean about the inventory? So on this one, on the north, insert item filter gold and this one north insert item filter Thirtus. on north insert uh, item filter Diamond. Okay. <clears throat> and then I also want to extract on white. So if I put that gold in there. That goes into there, nowhere else. And that stays in there for the minute. Okay. Okay, I'm getting there. I'm working it out. Okay. And then if I just put, let's say, one of them, one of them, one of them. Oh, I get it. Okay. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Yeah, it's going to put all of them in. All right. What this means is I need a bunch more item filters, basically. But I understand what I'm doing now. So I need a few. Probably not so. That many gold nuggets, let's say. And let's make some more um, item cards. Good, we've got another six. What do we want to do on the app? So this one is extract okay and then we also want to insert on orange okay and then this one on the north we want to extract on orange same with these oop no Extract orange, north, extract 
contract on orange and north do that where did that go on the south north contract on orange that's insert on orange <clears throat> and then on the north we've got want to insert on white the red the redstone yeah and then on the up you want to insert That's on the up. Maybe if we do it on the south. Insert on white. Item filter. Silicon. Okay, that's not going to work. West, down even, <clears throat> give me a second, I'll be right back, alrighty, I'm back, I think I figured it out, what I needed to do there was get that chest away from here to start with. So I've got a north um, redstone being inserted. So if I put on the up item card in there and then give that a filter, it'll be on the white because that's fine. And on the up, we give it uh, silicon. And then on the down. What is this card doing? On the down, we give it over that. 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 Is this going to work? We're going to see. No. no. Insert channel zero. Alright, pause, be back in a second. Okay, I think I got it. <clears throat> okay. Um, right. So, <clears throat> what I had to do was... It's all on the north side because it's the north side of this IO. So you have it on north. But what you had to do is insert on the down. I put the three. And I didn't mean to do that. Uh, let's In there okay <clears throat> so they go into the down and then this one goes into the up so they insert so the only thing I need to do now is um because I've got all three printed now is that if I put on the north side do this one and make this extract on purple Yep. And then on the up, I need one more item card, I believe. 
Yes. One more item card. Uh, da, 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 da. uh, uh, no, uh, yes. <clears throat> and if I go on the up from there, and add in, and we have insert on, oops, insert on purple. So is that on extract on purple? All right, so there's only one way to um, actually test this, and that's just actually test it. No? So we're going to have a silicon, a redstone, diamond. That should be it, right? Right. If you put all three in here, we're hopefully going to see it do its magic. No. In there, and it goes in there, and the sun goes in there, and then that goes in there. Make them, and that gets extracted back to there. Perfect. All right, so that's automated as far as we can go without an actual AE system. So that's perfect. So if I want a logic processor, for example, I would put one silicone, one redstone, okay, a calculation, and one certus quartz in here. And I sit back. Wait for a minute. Let the inscribers do their thing. Goes in and that goes in and it goes back out again. And there I've got my calculation processor. Perfect. So all I need to do now is put the materials into there. Now once I've got an AE system, I will get the computer to actually put them in there for me. Oh, it's a moth. Cool. All right, um, there's pillagers outside my base again. Let's go kill them before we wrap up the episode. All right, that was painful, but it needed to be done. <clears throat> uh, they are all around my base, why? Okay, that one just kind of disappeared. All went down here. Yeah, there he is. Horrible little guys. And I need my jetpack. <laughs> Let's get these other ones. Oh, I made a mistake. I need to get rid of that. All my sheeps. Yes, I know that's not the plural. Another one over here, but he disappeared. Where did he disappear to? Oh, they're down there. What the hell is going on down there? You know what? They can stay down there for now. I don't care. Looks like pain. Actually, you know what? No, screw it. I don't like you. Never liked you. One down. Two down. Three down. You horrible beings. The other one's right over here. Somewhere. Where you at, bro? Here. There he is. Goodbye, pillagers. I don't know why they keep coming. There must be a spawner somewhere, and I'm going to have to go find it one day. All right. Well, that is it for episode 10. I am a pincushion of arrows. Look at me. But, um... We got the automation of the circuits done, and that's going to allow me to progress a lot easier and quicker rather than standing there doing it one by one by one, which is really painful. Um, but that's going to help with the next episode. So thank you very much for watching, and until next time.